Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. I greatly appreciate you being here. So I'm currently getting ready to go to a little uh, get together slash dinner. I figured, you know what, why not have a little bit of fun with makeup and film it. And with that being said, I don't really want to ramble too much because I am on a time frame here. So if you'd like to have a little bit of fun with makeup with me, kind of chit chat just a little bit and watch me get ready, then please keep watching. Alright guys, so like I said, I am on a time frame. As a matter of fact, I am getting ready a little bit later than I wanted to. <sighs> Story of my life. Therefore, I already do have on my foundation and concealer just to save a little bit of time. So now I'm just going to go ahead and grab my Jeffree Star Cosmetics Androgyny Palette. I'm so excited about this. I think I'm going to start out by grabbing this shade right here called Safe Word. It's kind of light, so it really might not show up on my skin tone too well. Um, but I do just want to lay it down in the uh, crease as a nice transition shade. Oh, it does show up a little bit. I was nervous because of my skin tone, but it does kind of show up. I didn't really want to do too, too much makeup because um, it's like 100 degrees outside. But because I'm a stay-at-home mom, the times I actually get to go out and dress up and all that, they come few and far between. So, you know what? Why not? And I do just kind of want to play with color, so why not just take it there? Um, I'm grabbing the Morphe M433, and I'm going to reach in right here and grab the shade Swallow. So I'm just going to start putting this color um, pretty much all the way on the eye. This is going to be the main color that I use. I'm putting it in the crease, um, on the lid, really just everywhere. Just smoking it out and blowing it out. So as I mentioned, it is like 100 degrees here. Again, not really, but that's definitely what it feels like. I feel like we just totally missed spring. Like, was spring not a thing this year? Because I swear we just we just completely missed it. It went straight from the little short winter that we had straight to summer, I swear. And then I was looking at the weather, and it's supposed to rain, like, all next week. Unless it changes, it's supposed to rain, like, every day next week. Like, wait a minute, what? It's about to be June. Like, did April showers miss the memo? Like, you're late to the party. You are supposed to be here a couple months ago. At this point, we're, we're just looking for our flowers. We don't want all this rain. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of don't like when it rains. I know we need it, uh, but I just feel like it's, it's just really gloomy. Like, it gives me kind of like a gloomy, unmotivated mood. And then if you have plans, it semi-ruins them sometimes, depending on what it is. And it's just not... I don't know. I don't like when it rains. And again, I'm really just kind of going in there with that blue. I kind of want to keep this look really, really simple, but at the same time, super glam. Seriously, my nose is sweating. Like, what the world? All right, so now I'm just going to grab this kind of liquid glitter from Stila. This is one of their Magnificent Metals, um, and it's in the shade Rose Gold Retro. I'm just going to take this and start laying it down, kind of like I would if I was um, carving out the crease for a cut crease. I'm just going to lay that down ever so slightly oh yes i love these stila things and what's crazy is this is actually the only one that i have um although there are so many other colors and they are so gorgeous i really got to re-up on these things i haven't used this in a while um so i forgot just how awesome they were and i've obviously forgotten to re-up on some other colors because this is just and it's so convenient because you can just like swipe it on and you are good to go so speaking of summer uh do you guys have any like fun things planned uh for this upcoming summer let me know down below if you do i'd really love to hear what you guys got going on as for me i am honestly not even really sure yet we did uh want to take a little beach trip but uh, I don't know if that's going to happen. We have to get some things in order um, first. But there is one thing that I'm sure of that will be happening this summer. And that is me being driven absolutely bonkers by my children. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, but not really. I'm sure you moms out there can relate. But we will get through it just like we always do. No, but actually my son's birthday is actually coming up on June 2nd. He will be three years old. And then my daughter, I will be getting her prepped uh, for the new school year. She'll actually be going to second grade like whoa where has the time gone uh whoo and then her birthday is coming up in september and she'll be turning eight so a lot of events and birthdays planned uh next week we have a graduation to go to a graduation party to go to then my son's birthday we also have kind of like a gender reveal party thing going on for another family member and wow we just 
because we got a lot going on and hopefully we will be able to take our beach trip like we want but if not that's okay too the beach isn't going anywhere so now I'm just going to grab a little bit more of that blue that we use and I'm going to use that to kind of blend out the edges of that glitter just so it's all kind of blended in seamlessly and it all runs together and blends together nicely so while we're sitting here talking about the summer and I'm using uh, one of Jeffrey's palettes um, if you are a Jeffrey fan, then can we just talk about the fact that he just launched some new merch and he has a new um, equality palette coming out June 1st and he's already talking about launching a new summer eyeshadow palette like wait a minute what? Uh, oh my gosh, I've got to get my bank account ready because I already need it all. Like I haven't even seen it all and I already know I need it all. I just love Jeffree Star. Like, I can't help it. I'm also just going to take that same blue shade and run it along my lower lash line. Alright, so I don't think I'm going to do liquid liner today because I don't want to take away from this eye look here. We don't want to take away from this glitter moment. We do not. Um, so I'm not going to do liquid liner. So what I'm going to do is just really fast off camera, I'm going to apply some mascara and lashes. And I will be back to finish off the rest of the face. Wham, bam, thank you, man. Oh, love a good lash. You guys have seen me use these before. These are the Christina lashes um, in the WSP style. Um, I love these because they are long and kind of glam, but still kind of natural-esque. And also not too dramatic to where it completely just covers uh, the eye look to where you can't see it. So, I love these. Nicole Guerrero definitely turned me on to these, and I've been using them since. For bronzer, I'm just grabbing my Ray Ray palette, going in with the shade Mocha. Yes, I need a refill because these two right here, if you can't tell, are my favorites. Um, I don't know how you would ever guess that, um, but Radiance and Mocha are the most used ones. As I am bronzing my face as I normally do, I just have one question for you guys. Just one. Are you ready? Yanny or Laurel? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Um, unless you have just been absolutely living under a rock, um, then I'm pretty sure you know what I mean by that. But if not, there was this like viral thing going around. Um, it was like a little saying and some people heard Yanny, some people heard Laurel. Kind of like that, you remember that white and gold uh, dress thing that was going around? a while ago that was was the dress white and gold or was it like black and blue or something like that yeah kind of one of those things where different people heard different things i think it's kind of over now because the creator of it actually came out and stated that it actually did say laurel so i'm just curious what you guys heard um when this whole thing started for the first time I listened to it I heard Yanny then the very next day I went right back to the same video the same one that I watched the day before and I swear to you plain as day I heard Laurel and I'm like oh my god what is happening like what is this oh my god it was crazy I'm not the only person that that happened to either um I saw online a lot of people saying that they heard one thing one time and then they would go back to the same video and hear something different so crazy Alright, I'm just going to take a little bit of blush. This is my Makeup Revolution um, Hot Spice Palette. I'm just going to kind of mix these three shades right here together. I do that a lot. Just kind of pick, pick a couple colors, swirl them together, and come up with my own unique blush shade. I like doing that sometimes. But of course, we got to tap off the excess because we don't want to look like a clown. And then for a highlight today, I'm going to be going in with my Morphe Times Bretman palette. And I'm going to be going in with the shade right down here called Get Laid. And of course, just highlighting in all of my normal places. And as I am doing this, I did just kind of want to take the time and say thank you guys so much. I'm at like 970 something subscribers, so we are getting very close to 1K. And I'm just... Oh my gosh. I know that that number may not really be big, too big in um, YouTube world, but let me tell you, it's big to me. It's big in my heart. Um, it means so much to me. Obviously, I made this channel years ago, but then I took that hiatus 
and when I came back I had just a little over 400 um, subscribers that stuck around and are still here today um, plus others and it is literally the most exciting thing ever making videos is so fun to me it literally brings me so much joy it also helps with my anxiety and I know that's the strangest thing ever if you don't have um, anxiety you may not understand but it really does help with my anxiety and then I get to share some of the things I love I get to share that with all of you um, and even some things that I go through I can share with you guys and maybe um, motivate you guys or inspire you guys and that right there that is all that I want whether I inspire you guys with weight loss or just anything in life um, that is my goal and that is my focus to inspire others in some way shape or form there's obviously so much more that I want to and plan to share with you guys it gets me excited just thinking about it and I just, I don't know, I just cannot wait. I, I really don't know what to say right now. When I talk about it, it just gets me really excited and happy and all like giddy to the point where I'm speechless. So just know that I am so happy and I'm so appreciative um, for you guys and for this outlet. Um, there is so much more to come um, and I can't wait and I hope you guys can't either and yeah. Thank you. Thank you for subscribing in the first place. Thank you for watching my videos and thank you for um, your constant support. It means more to me than you'll ever ever know. Um, I just want you guys to know that and always know that. Alright so really quick for my lips. Obviously I just outlined and filled them in with a brown uh, lip liner and now I'm just going to go in with this Wet n Wild Mega Last Lipstick in the shade Bear It All. It's a really gorgeous nude shade. I like I'm obsessed with this. I'm just going to put that directly on top of the brown. And then on top of that, I'm just going to go in with this NYX Butter Gloss um, in the shade Fortune Cookie. This is going to help gloss it up and also add just the smallest tint of pink to it. Not much at all. Alrighty, a little bit of MAC Fix Plus to seal the deal and we are officially done. Alright guys, that is it. Um, I really hope you all enjoyed this little, quick little uh, chit chat, get ready with me. It's my very first one, but nonetheless, again, I hope you all enjoyed. I also hope you love how this makeup look um, came out, because I know I did. I've also never done anything kind of like this using these colors, so that's good. I love doing different things that I haven't done before and using colors that I haven't used before. Uh, so yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and give me a big thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already i'm about to get ready to go stuff my face at this little dinner slash get together don't worry today is sunday that i'm filming this so therefore it is my cheat day so yes i'm about to go do that now i hope you guys have a great rest of your week uh, i love you all and i'll see you in the next one